Hi everybody and welcome back to the medium town of Revilia, where our women walk around with shields to protect themselves. It's fine. Um, we have to actually, we have to hop in straight away. I'm going to pause it because it is springtime and check this out. We got berries coming in. We have to move some people around and make some things work, make some changes because we need food in a major way and yeah we have to get people rolling here so we have five people building no let's put two there and we'll also put two here oh check this out our skeleton crew has been getting the herbs nice that'll be good for our sick population i'm gonna go ahead and just max this max that one out and we're gonna pull people from production right we'll leave one there and we have that's a stable no business there there we go the clay furnace will take this all the way down to one beautiful and max that out nice we have six people left over i want to get them on the farms because check this out people are plowing by hand that's good stuff we want to make this nice and even so we'll put four people there oh, i'm hoping we can spread this out as much as i would like to uh, we need we still need a builder. All right, we'll leave that for now Let's go ahead and unpause it. Let everybody move around. Ah, good stuff. All right. I also I want to check in Oh, there's so much to do. Let's check in on our food trades. Yeah, we're still importing everything I'm thinking we're gonna up this number even more Not right now, but we need so much more food and I was looking, we built this large plot and we put chickens there. We should really change this to carrots. Can we, can we demolish the chicken? We can, nice. Can we afford it? Awesome, nice. We'll get more vegetables in there. And then we have this, we can't afford it right now anyway. We have goat house. Ah, oh, look at them, we have some goats in the fields already we're gonna have to make this a veggie field as well it will forever be known as goat house i love it and maybe one day it will house ghost goats once again but we don't need all that space for goats we need all that space for veggies nice all right we made those changes so many i know everyone is just really sad right now my approval, not the best, and it's all to do with food. We can't upgrade any more of these homes to advance because we don't have the food. But it's springtime, and I really do feel as though we can nip this in the butt. Ha oh, ha, guys, check this out. All right, I had to pause it for this. Look at this. We're making tools, right? For trade, we can't trade the tools i'm not even sure what they would be under i think they're under this no it doesn't matter we don't we can't afford the trade route so we can't do anything with the tools we're just stockpiling them so i had a thought i know that we could sell weapons we have been selling weapons so i was thinking about telling the guy that's making tools to make weapons so i went to look to see what weapons we can sell and we already have the root for pole arms. We have 76 in surplus. We should probably start exporting that for just a whole ton of money, right? That sounds good. Maybe keep... I'm going to set this to 15 for a second and go ahead and unpause this. I am so excited. We're going to be rich. <laughs> How many pole arms do we have? This is our pole arm militia, so a full unit is 36 so if we wanted to raise just about half a unit do like 15 maybe we'll keep 15 in stock just in case we have to raise half a unit on the fly right cool so we're gonna be filthy rich that is set to 15 nice ah oh, that is amazing so pole arms who is making tools where is oh god this is gonna take a while to find um what what are you blacksmith good 
Like you're making tools. No, no, no. Make pole arms. They're more fun. Do that for now. We'll make tools later. Oh, we're gonna be rich. <laughs> nice. All right. I also I took some people from our stone cutters. I still had some people there, and I put them into the farms so that they could do some more plowing by hand because that sounds like fun and I don't want to deny people the fun of plowing by hand. All right, they finally finished goat house. So uh, I figured we should probably stop and take a look and admire goat house before we destroy it. I like what they did with the property. Look at this. They got the big house in the corner. They got this little goat shed somewhere in the middle. They got this other thing on the side. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, but we really need veggies. They're good for you. Get out of here, goats. Stupid goats. There you go. <laughs> you got some veggies. I mean, quite honestly, goats just really seem like dumb animals, don't they? You just look a goat in the eye and you just know there's nothing going on behind those eyes. They just look like such idiots. I'm sorry if anybody really likes goats out there. I have nothing against goats. I am I was very happy with Goat House. I'm sad that it has to go. I just think goats are really dumb. Alright, made some more changes. Uh, we got another family just moved in, which is good. I'm gonna put them on this farmhouse so that they can have the joy of plowing by hand. Uh, we finished the communal oven here and I maxed it out so that they could just pump out the bread. That's a livestock thing. I was looking, oh, here it is, the windmill. Look how much flour is still there. And, oh, pantry's full. Where? Uh-oh. The forager's hut, they're killing it. And this stuff is still, still growing. And we have two things just full. Oh, that's wonderful. Good stuff, we're finally up to three months of food. Ah. That is awesome. We have no builders, but there's nothing really to build at the moment. We have 112 homes and only 99 families. Ah, I think we're going to be good. I really want to get these farmhouses maxed out, though. That's the only problem, because all these people are plowing by hand, but I don't want to take away from the bakeries because they still have so much to do. There's 118 flour there, 160 there, and these two are still maxed out pumping out the stuff and somehow okay the meat is gone meat got here somehow don't know how they're not supposed to have meat there but all right nice oh, all right things are looking good we got a whole bunch of money in i'm guessing we sold some weapons that's nice we're a we're an arms manufacturer good stuff i took away from our charcoal areas because we have nine months of fuel I'm, I'm going to leave them down at that level for a while. But this is good. Things are looking up. Things are definitely looking in our favor. And I really think that these gigantic vegetable areas are going to help so much. We're probably going to add some more soon. Maybe, oh, we could fit one down here. We have no one to build, so I'm not even going to bother, but that is a perfect little area. I like that. Ooh, since we have the money, and quite a bit of it, in smaller plots like this, this is where we should get some chickens. You can get some chickens in these smaller plots. They don't need that much room, right? They're chickens. They're tiny. We may want to consider getting goats as well. Where, where can we have Goat House 2.0? Construction finished? Oh, we finished building. Oh, this stuff. Duh. All right, cool. Um, where are we going to go? What is this? Oh, we already got chickens there. That would have been a nice... It's right next to the weaver's shop, too. Ah, oh, shouldn't we have goats here? We have to. <laughs> Getting rid of that. I want goats here. It's very important. There we go. Goat house 2.0. Right on the corner next to the weaver shop. Awesome. I like that. All right. Do we have some? I don't want to spend too much money because we do still have orders for food that I still really want to crank up a bit. We have negative 10 honey. How did this honey go missing or cease to be? I don't understand. Please, someone please find the missing honey. 
And this pantry is full. Ah, we need to we need another granary or maybe just to upgrade. Is this one already upgraded? Wow. I want to do this. And I'm going to. Good. We're upgrading that to a gigantic granary. Hopefully we can get more people to work here once they upgrade it. Because we need people to move stuff around. We can't have these things all full. Look at this. Are the people just being lit? Look, they're playing with oxen now. And going home. <laughs> because their pantry's full. Possibly. <gasps> oh, look at this. Three months. Three months now. We have no warnings. Ah, happy day. Thank goodness. Stupid food. Uh-oh. Game just said an enemy unit has been spotted. Just what we need. To be embarrassed by bandits again. Where are they coming from? We have to do this properly this time, right? I don't see them anywhere. They're not- oh. Okay. They're moving. Their effectiveness is 101%. Impossible. <laughs> Come on. Alright. Is that all of them? Okay, we are going to call our forces very, very, very early on. How far are they? We should call them now, right? Alright, where do we want to meet them? We're going to have to meet them in this field out here. I'm hoping... Yeah, there... Oh, there's two. Okay. Alright, I think it's go time. <laughs> Let's do this. I'm going to rally all of our troops... And we are not going to lose this fight this time. Come on, guys. Straight away. Lickety split. Everybody get up here to this field. Ah, <sighs> I'm nervous. I'm a little nervous. Alright, how far are they? They have to come through some woods. So, that's definitely going to slow them down. I don't know how fighting with these fields in the way is going to work, so uh, I don't know if we really have enough room to over there. I'm hoping they'll just come to us wherever we are, and we could just form up here. We'll make them nice and thin. gonna draw rough lines of where I want them. We get our main troops, our retinue right in the middle, and we'll get these guys off to the side to do some flanking. And then archers in the back. Good. Alright boys, come on down, it's fighting time. Alright, we got four units of clubs. 18 apiece. We should have this, no problem, right? I certainly hope so. How you boys feeling? Is everybody feeling good? Feeling fresh? Alright. This is good stuff. Alright, how we doing? Still got some troops coming up. Our archers are taking their sweet ass time. Guys, if you're not running, balanced, how? Run. Guys, we need you running. You guys, run. Please. Everybody go. Alright, we have some of our troops up here. The rest we have running. Can we just tell everybody, like, if you're... If you're not running, please do so. No, 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 everybody, yes, run. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Ooh, they're getting close. All right. Let's try and reform these lines. Oh, here they come. All right, nice, quick. Get up here. Close as you can. Start shooting as soon as you can. More spear militia. 
just gonna put you guys straight to the front. Nice, projectiles are flying. Sending in our front line in straight away. Our retinue. Bring up the side. Bring these guys up the side. Oh, go at it, guys. Get in there. There we go. Nice. Oh, we, we killed him. They never stood a chance. I leave. I leave. There we go. Oh, look at that. Oh, I think we actually did it proper this time. We defended Revilia, and we got them running. Don't trample our crops when you're running away, I swear to God. Don't make me murder you twice. Alright, they're fleeing. How you doing? Oh, look at us. Everybody's just thrilled to death. We did it. Do you want to hunt them down? Oh, you can't. We can't hunt them down. We have to just let them flee. Oh, man. Good job, guys. Look at this. You know what that means. We're going to have to build ourselves another monument to our greatness. Ah, where where are they? Oh man, that is great. I'm so happy that finally for once we'll build it right on the corner here. Ah, so good. All right, look at all of our troops. I just disbanded them. They're off. Good job, guys. You did great. What a good battle. Oh, man. We did it. I did notice their work. Yeah, there's quite a few bodies here. We're gonna have to uh, man the corpse pit. How you doing? Doing all right? You guys did great. Look at this. Look, they're all talking about it. Oh, did you see that one guy's throat that I slashed? It was crazy. Oh, they're gonna have such stories around the campfire tonight. Nice. Alright. So, <laughs> the battle of... I don't know what to name this battle. I was gonna pick somebody. The battle of Peter Farm, maybe? Linhart? This is the person... You know what? We're naming it after you. I saw him earlier. Linhart Farm. He was a farmer. And then there's probably like 20 people named Linhart in this game I did see a farmer I was I wanted to call it like the Battle of North Farm or something like that but having it named after a person Linhart I'm just gonna imagine it was you who did all this crazy work good job you're the hero of the battle we're naming it after you oh my goodness happy day we need to take someone away from somewhere so that we could uh I'm just gonna pause I ah, forget pausing it it's fine Let's have a think. Where can we take someone away? Look at all of these berries. Jeez. And these are fully staffed. That's awesome. We're up to four months of food. We finally did it. We broke out. I had a feeling this spring and summer was going to see us through. Look how much money we have too. Jeez. Alright. Temporarily, we're going to take one family off baking bread. Alright. One family from baking bread to moving dead bodies and throwing them in the pit. You know? It's not that different of a job change, right? It's not that much of a career change. Holy crap. I have to get in on this conga line. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, man. We need, like, some kind of war music going on or something. Look at our boys marching back. <laughs> <laughs> that is so cool. I can't believe how many there are. Oh, this is fantastic. We finally have a nice, solid victory. 
Oh, nice. Another family just joined us. I'm gonna restaff that. Uh, where is it? There it is. Communal oven. Perfect. Since we have food, I'm wondering can we upgrade any of these? We can. Nice. I really want to get one of these. Oh, I forgot. That's locked behind something. I wanted to get one of these as a bakery. Ah, uh, how far off is that? Where is that? I have questions. So many questions. Where is this? Bakeries. So we have to get the plow first. I really think we should get the orchard first before we do that. Ah, oh, there's so much stuff I want to get. <laughs> this game is awesome. I'm loving it. Um, this family. Yeah, you're gonna have some transporting to do. Look, another Linhart. Crazy. Oh, carrying a body too. Man. Alright. How how big do you think our graveyard's gonna get now? Where is it? Where am I? I get so lost. How many do we have here now? Got four, eight, nine, ten, eleven? Okay. We have eleven. Since we also just got tons of money in, I want to make sure that we have small chicken plots in these little areas, right? We're, we're going to have those huge vegetable estates that we built. Oh, look at this. It's gigantic. We're not going to build any more homes until these are nice and full. Because they have space for two families each. We expanded all of them. But while we wait... We could do with more chickens, right? Who doesn't like some chickens? You can use some chickens. There you go. Look at that. Happy day. You want chickens? Bam! Your dreams came true on this day. I can't do anything with that. It's being built. Same thing with that. Alright. Are we chickened out? I think we are chickened out. Yeah. Alright. Good stuff. Oh, wait. Wait. There's more chickens to be had. There is indeed more. Oh, dear lord. And goats. You gotta throw some goats in there every now and then, right? They need a little bit more space. They got a little bit more space to maneuver and do goat-like things. Wow. 29 bodies need burial. A lot of people uh, bit the big one there. You just, uh, Ot, you feeling okay? He's just waiting. Ot, what are you waiting on? Why did you choose to wait here? Ot, I worry about you. It's the quiet ones you have to worry about. Oh, look at this. Look at this. We have a fifth sheep. Oh, happy day. That is so cool. I'm not sure how many I want before we start selling them, right? Because we do need the wool. Let's look at this. People are t they're waiting and they're playing with oxen because they don't have enough stuff to do. It's terrible. And what about, where's our weaver shop? I have one somewhere. I put one somewhere, here it is. What do you have? You have some yarn? That's nice. Yeah, at least Peter's doing some transporting. But there's a whole bunch of waiting going on. That's not good. That is not good. It will not do. Waiting is terrible. I miss Goat House. Ah, oh, check this out. Gonna have to go ahead and pause it. It is May. The very end of spring, so it's about to be summer. Crops are just gonna be growing and such. So all of our people in our farmhouse, they're not gonna have anything to do. We're gonna pull everybody. Everybody must go except for the bare minimum of people just hanging out, you know? Everybody deserves a break every now and then. So we give those those two families and those two farmhouses just a nice little break. Fantastic. All right, since we have a bunch of people, there are some bodies that need dealing with, right? We're going to put an extra family on that and an extra family dealing with this. Because that's just, you know, it's disrespectful to just leave them, <laughs> to just leave them in the presence of Ot, who, <laughs> I don't, I don't know what kind of joy he gets out of sitting in a field of dead bodies, but 
it disturbs me. So if we can get people to please clean that up so I don't have to worry about art anymore, that'd be real nice. And also, if we could build this shrine to our victory, that would also be nice. Come on, Ott. You're freaking me out, man. Alright, well, that is where I'm going to have to go ahead and end this episode with this wonderful sight. Just carrying a dead body down the road, just taking him for a walk. It's nice, right? Ah, but good news. So much good news this episode. Not only did we win... Just straight up murdered those bandits. We proved ourselves in battle quite effectively. We surrounded them and just broke them. It was good. We did very well. What a view. Jeez, this is nice. And also, we got food under control. I think we're going to be good. I understand how food works now, I think. So, it's time to prepare ourselves for some more construction some more advancing and taking this town from medium to real real big oh, i'm looking forward to it and i'm loving this game i hope you guys are enjoying watching if you are enjoying watching hit that like button subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos and i will see you guys in the next one bye bring this here move that there on and on Oh, this is heavier than it looks.